the Benidorm Enthusiast here with Benidorm Stuff YouTube channel. Today's video is all about new bars, some of which are still under construction. We've got an update for you on the eagerly anticipated brand new Sinatras and some bars which are already open, including the one opened by the star of the hit TV show Bag in Loving Brits, Happy Days Graham. Our first stop is just off the Levante Beach, up this little side street. Let's go take a look. Our first stop today is just off the Levante beachfront and it's called The Three Amigos. We featured this bar last year when it opened as Sunny Beach but it has since been taken over again and it's now run by Pablo, Blanco and Cooper and their owners Gillian and John. Gillian, lovely to see you. Nice to see you, thanks for coming. So tell us a little bit about the idea behind Three Amigos and your plans for the future. Uh, well, we have three dogs, um, Cooper, Blanco and Pablo. This is Blanco, yeah? Yeah, that's Blanco. Um, and we call them the Three Amigos, so um, it made sense to name the bar after them. We are doggy people, it's a doggy friendly bar. All dogs are welcome here, so um, yeah, anybody passing by with their dog can come in and get a treat. And, and this drink. is Cooper. This is He's Cooper. Come to say hello, show his face. Yeah, getting the treats. So you've got a lovely sunny terrace. Yeah, very sunny. Yeah, it's nice, nice in the summer. This street's really uh, coming to life now. It's great to see. Yeah, you get a lot of pass and trade coming up and down to and from the beach. So um, it's starting to pick up now. We're starting to see a difference. So and is it just drinks? or do food as well? Food and drink. Yeah, we have a have a menu today. Um, we're doing our Sunday lunches, which are very popular. So. Um, yeah, but we have a full menu as well, snacks and doggy treats. Yeah, lots Plenty. of doggy treats. Lots of doggy treats. <laughs> well, I wish you all the best for the future. Thank you very much. And I hope the dogs have a fantastic life in Spain now. That's great, thank you very much. Thanks for coming. Thank you. On to the Avenida Mediterraneo next and right opposite the newly refurbished Riador Hotel, another place that is going to be a brand new cafe bar. This was previously Vigna del Mar Cafe. I'm sure some of you will have stayed at the Vigna del Mar apartments. Now it's been refurbed and it's going to be opening as Florida Cafe. We're into the new town for our next stop today on Calle Lepanto. This bar is in between the Ibrox Bar and Helen's Bar, right opposite Churchill's. We featured this bar way back in January when they'd first taken over the premises. Now, Jan and Jose have had an extremely tough time over the last six months. You'll hear a bit about that in a second. But they are getting close to opening now. So let's have a look at Cougar Cocktails. Jan, it's lovely to see you again. Thank you. The bar's looking fabulous. Thank you. Tell us a little bit about what's gone on the last six months. Oh, um, my partner who was there, um, unfortunately had a brain aneurysm. So he's been in the hospital quite a long time and then into rehab. So the building work had to stop. Um, we had a few months away. It was actually had options. It was in a coma. It was in a coma for one month. Yes. Yeah. Um, so very ill. Um, but we decided that this was our dream. So we're going to continue with the dream. Good on you. Um, so got the builders in, and now created what we what we started to make our happy place hopefully yeah. hopefully <laughs> in the whole day he's okay he's doing well he's doing well he needs to take it a little bit easier mm -hmm. but other than that yes so yes. what are your plans for cougar cocktails oh well we're hoping well, we're hoping due to bureaucracy and everything else that we can open i would say in the next week brilliant next week okay and then hopefully let people come in and let's start another happy place that's what i want to just do. a happy place happy place chill out chill out chill out area here, there's another sofa to come here, outside will be the terrace, um, we just wait for a music system which is obviously imperative, yeah. um, but hopefully then open the doors and, and have a lovely chill area and everyone chill out with cocktails in this lovely hot weather. <laughs> I love the colour scheme, it's very okay. calming, it's very relaxing, it feels, um, feels kind of like Mediterranean, that's yeah, what Yeah, it feels today. like a happy place. Oh, thank you. So I hope you're going to be very happy here for the future and I wish oh, you and Jose lovely. the best of luck. Thank you. Thank you. <laughs> Next along, we've got a quick update on the brand new Sinatra's bar. 
just around the corner from the old venue, also on Calle Lepanto. It's looking much further along in the construction than on our last update. They've got the signage up and it's all the same branding as before. It's looking great so far. Open terrace at the front and inside is where they'll have all the live shows and more of a nightclub atmosphere. I'm sure this is going to be a fantastic venue. No opening date yet, but it doesn't seem like they're far away. In between the old Sinatras and the new Sinatras, straight opposite champions at the top of the square, is another new bar in the making. This one is going to be called Camden Town and we've got a couple of sneak peek pics for you, concept pictures of what this bar will look like. Again, no opening date set yet for this venue, but we will of course keep you updated and bring you more videos when there's more to see. Onto the main strip road now, Calle Girona, at what used to be Rovers Return. So the Rovers was a massive venue, it's now been split, part of it is still the Rovers but it's a much smaller establishment and the other side is going to be a brand new bar. They're not 100% sure on the name yet, but they have decided it's going to be a modern, fun and funky place for you guys to enjoy. We'll keep you updated on this one as it comes along. Over to the Rincon de Loix area of Benidorm now on the Calle Laundries at Sonder Bar. This isn't a new bar as such, but it is under new ownership now. Uncle Ron's group have taken over Sonder. They've already got one bar on this street, Uncle Ron's. They've also got Auntie Bell's in the new town and they've got the Twisted Cocktail Chain which we'll be featuring here at Sonder Bar. Up to the far end of Rincon de Loix now on the stretch known as Camping Corner and this is another brand new bar recently opened. This one has been opened by one of the stars from the hit TV show Bargain Loving Brits. Yes, Happy Days Graham has now got his own bar and what else could he call it? Yeah, it had to be Happy Days. Graham! Happy Days Jackie, how are you? Great to see you. And you Jackie. Congratulations on the bar. Oh, thank you very much. It's up three to weeks? Great. Yeah, three weeks. Uh, uh, it's been a long three weeks. Yeah. Hard work. Um, have I regretted it? Uh, after about the fourth day I thought what have I done? <laughs> <'Cause> I, <laughs> I was only working six hours a week, and uh, I'll give all, I'll give them six hours up and turn it into um, about forty hours a week now. But you get about six hours sleep a week well, now. Well, do you know I, I've left for them all. It's been a, a blessing, and um, of course I can spend more time here. And it's more. I don't work beyond the bar. I, I just do the meet and greeting. Yeah. And I've appreciated all the people that have come up in taxis. Uh, catching trams. Um, I didn't realise how popular Happy Days was. Yeah, you're so. massive. You've well, got a massive didn't. following. <laughs> Everybody loves you. Happy Days, our kids. Yeah, so, you're uh, a great bloke. And uh, and and do you know some at Benny um I've had a walk around Benny Dorm and um, it's back to its normal self, isn't it? Above and beyond, so. I yeah, think. Yeah, I think. And that's down to people like yourself. Thank you. You've been promoting it, and the camera guys, and you know, you've done an absolutely fabulous yeah. job. And people tell me that all the time. So, you know, people like you, you've done some fantastic. It's a massive team effort from all of us that love Benidorm. We've all... Um... All the bar owners, all the restaurant owners, you know, they've all been on the videos, they've all put their input in. Um, it was the best idea I, I'd imagine you've ever come up with. Um, we could not to say. Um, it's been a, you, you, you and a few others have brought many going back to its, its uh, former glory, should we and say. And yourself. And of um, course, and Bargain Loving days. Brits. Well, Bargain Brits, uh, they're back out this week. Yeah. Uh, so we'll be doing, I think it's the eighth series. Wow. I know, eight years. Um, that's unreal. Isn't it really? And that's, I mean, Bargain Loving Brits has done fantastic things for Benny as well. Well, it's done fantastic for me because. Uh, Without them and the support of the, the, the public back home and here, uh, I wouldn't be sat here now with a, with a bar called Happy Days. Right, there you go. There and you, go. Uh, you know they give me they give me the um, the okay to use their logo, okay. which they don't normally uh, give out. But uh, and I thought right, that's brilliant. And of course, when the buses are going past and 
the coaches, the, the, the TUI coaches and Jet2 coaches, they bring the, the people from the airport and they bring them down here. And they point it out. And they slow down so people, and, and you, you, all you hear is happy days, our kid. <laughs> <laughs> and Bag and Loving Bits has been nominated for an award as yes, well. Yes, it, it, it's, it's been nominated for a, a TV Choice Award. Um, now, the voting is up until the 24th of June. Um, and if any anybody's out there, please do me a favour. Uh, if you've watched the programme, you enjoy the programme, please go on to TV Choice Awards 2022 on Google and uh, make your vote. Um, because if Benny Dorm deserves anything, he needs another award. And it's down to the many people that have been on the show over the years. Um, they deserve it and Benny Dorm deserve it as well. I think Benny Dorm TV show. They got an award, they won the award, so if they can do it, well, can't bargain the Wimbricks. Absolutely, some fantastic characters on the programme, they deserve the recognition. <laughs> do you know the best thing about it is people say, oh, I love your character. It's and you! I, and I, and it's I, just I think, you! It's me, I'm not a character, I never made this up. <laughs> but no, it's been absolutely brilliant. The bar is doing really well. We're doing Sunday lunches, uh, our entertainment starts next week. Excellent. So, yeah, we, we'll go for it and uh, hopefully there's still a lot more things to do. We'll get that done and uh, hopefully, well, it will be happy days, I know. It will be. And we'll come back and do lots of updates and keep people um, how, it, how it's going. Happy days, our kids. Happy days, our kids. Take it easy. Thank you. All the best. Happy days. Yay! Happy days, Happy days, That's all for me today, guys. I hope you've enjoyed this video, having a look at some of the new bars around town in Benidorm. Make sure you get them on your list of places to see the next time you're here. Thanks for watching. Make sure you subscribe to the channel so you don't miss any of our future videos. And also check us out on Facebook, Instagram, Twitter, and TikTok at the Benidorm Enthusiast. Stay positive and stay safe. Oh, yeah.